So wireless safety is admittedly a very new concept, but it really uses the same kinds of techniques that existing safety solutions use today. The difference is that we've had to Im embed more intelligence at each end. So this is multiple processors, a lot of redundancy and parallel communications to enable the same levels of safety you'd get for, let's say, a traditional e-stop button. We can achieve the same thing over wireless by just putting more intelligence, more software, more hardware at each end and get the same kind of performance that you get over a wire, but over wireless. Obviously enabling a whole new set of applications where it's just not practical to either <laughs> pull a wire around or have to run to a uh, fixed location on a wall or run up to the back of a robot and try to stop it if that's the thing that's being dangerous. One of the big advantages of having this intelligence at each end and really not relying on the characteristics of the network itself is that we can then do our safety technology over virtually any network. Wired, Ethernet, serial buses, CAN buses, Bluetooth, proprietary radios, Wi-Fi, LTE and cellular. We've demonstrated all these kinds of applications which enables you to extend the safety network in ways that just has never been possible before.